Good evening, kingdom men and kingdom women. I truly hope you guys are having a blessed and beautiful day. Every day above ground is an awesome and beautiful day. Today is 9-11, you know, and I wasn't going to speak on this video on 9-11 today, but today, you know, um, I noticed the police on the side of the road with their lights on, their flashes on, and remembrance of the fallen, and I'm seeing people with their flags over the overpass in the remembrance of the fallen, and that just reminds me of when this first happened. I know all you guys remember where you were when y'all saw this tragic event, right? You know, at that time... I was in Fort Hood, Texas. I was a soldier at that time. And after seeing that, I just knew like, hey, we going to war. It's about to get ugly. It's about to get ugly right now. I, I was in disbelief, right? Just like all of y'all was in disbelief. Like I could not believe what I was seeing. It looked like it was a movie. You know, it looked like I was watching a Will Smith alien invasion movie, bro. It was wow right but what i want to speak on is the first responders right it's a video talking about this and it's called 9 11 exposed second edition now this video this is this is what they was talking about live you heard that the first time and after that you've never heard them talk about this right they only talk about the fallen right and they want to they want to uh capitalize off of the deaths of people right or use that as the ammo to make americans ah and you know they know how to play americans real well they're good at it america's americans still don't want to believe that we did not go to the moon or it's not what they say it is. The sun ain't as far as they say it is. But let's stick to the topic, right? Um, these first responders had some things to say. And I'm going to show y'all this video. Tell me what y'all think. All right? This is clearly, the, the, the way the structure is collapsing, this was the result of something that was planned. This is not, it's not accidental that the first tower just happened to collapse and then the second tower just happened to collapse in exactly the same way. How they accomplished this, we don't know. I mean, uh, so I've made it about a block. I've made it at least two blocks, and we saw it floor by floor instead of popping out. Was it, was it, was it, was it, was it Alright, now, I know y'all saw that, right? Tell me, listen to the first responders. Look at the way those buildings come down. And you tell me, tell me that that was something regular. And then the video is 9-11 uh, is Exposed, second edition. Go and watch the full video where they go in and they talk about the structure of the building, right? How they reinforce the building. You know, they saying that ain't no way that the heat, nothing should have melted. 
this building down. They're going to go in, in grave detail. Grave detail to counteract all the lies that was told. So I want you guys to peep out that video as well. It's 9-11 Exposed Second Edition. But I just want you guys to just keep your eyes open. Keep your eyes open. Be aware that we living in the end times. This is always, we've been living in the end times. Everything that um, that you see out here is not what you think you see. You know, God tells us, you know, that everything really is a lie out here. God's word is the only real word. God's truth is the only truth. He is the truth and he is the life. We got to put our faith in God so we don't have to worry about all these things that's happening. I just like to try to get you guys to, you know, look at it. Look at what's really going on, you know, and that'll give you an inkling of who the devil is, right? Then it'll show you who God is because you guys are here to make a decision to pick either God or the devil. You think you're here for homes, cars, your family, your kids, and different things like that. You're not here for that. You're here to make a choice. And it's a, it's a forever choice. You're here for your soul. This body is just a shell. It's just a vehicle. It is not the real you. This is not the real reality. This is not the last stop. There is a forever stop. So I just want you guys to just think about that and you guys have a blessed and beautiful day. Peace.